Department of Conservation has a fight on their hands. This time it's hitting close to home. Jonathan Gody tells us how they plan to win the battle over a tiny nuisance that can cause big problems. Smithville Lake is a boater and fisherman's paradise, and the Missouri Department of Conservation wants to keep it that way. But they're in a battle with these tiny zebra mussels, which have conservationists worried. They move into an area, they have unlimited amounts of food, they grow pr prolifically, uh, they take over the habitat that normal native species would use, they clog intake pipes, they stick to your holes of your boats, uh, they just become a huge nuisance once they get established. Ryan says they noticed the invasive species last fall and began planning a strategy to eliminate them. Today Today, they finally treated the lake with Cutrine Plus, an environmentally safe algicide. The Department of Conservation is applying 400 gallons of the chemical around the Camp Branch Marina, hoping to kill off the mussels, which threaten the food supply for native fish. They also cling to boat docks, props, and pumping stations. Conservationists say the mussels can be transported from lake to lake, mostly by boaters not even knowing they're adding to the problem. You want to clean your, your boats and your trailers before you move them from lake to lake. Uh, you want to let them dry out or just totally decontaminate them before you move them from one body to the other. Zebra mussels have already infested numerous lakes and rivers on both sides of the state line. Conservation Department will check on Smithville Lake over the next year, but believe today's procedure will prove successful. Jonathan Gody, NBC Action News. Conservation agents say today's treatment is environmentally friendly and will not harm the drinking supply, nor will it cause any harm to boaters, skiers, or swimmers. Mm.